welcome back to my channel honey breeze Designs. for those who are joining me for the first time welcome thank you for being here today with me um so today i am going to do another delivery unboxing so just like the other video that i'll go ahead and link up here it's not the typical unboxing of actual diamond paintings but um, unboxing of what's gonna be going into my stash so basically what i told my husband is hey I'm a diamond painter now and I need to have a stash. <laughs> so welcome to my stash. As I explained, you know, I do suffer from depression and anxiety and this helps me so much with that. Um, you know, we did suffer a child loss last year and then we also gave birth to our new baby boy who was a preemie. So it's just, you know, a lot that happened in life that this really really helps with and i encourage anyone and everyone out there who doesn't diamond paint to at least try it it's very very calming and it's very very relaxing i absolutely love it and i'm so happy that i found this hobby um but yeah so let's get to my stash okay i'm back um so i'm gonna actually start with my third party so like my mercari and my ebay purchases again i am on the hunt for some of diamond art club's um discontinued or retired products so i have been finding some thankfully on mercari and ebay and um i hope you guys don't take offense to this video i am in no way trying to show off or you know offend anyone by showing off my stash this is just because I'm excited and I'm new to the painting community and I just wanted to share with everyone and that way everyone can kind of see too um, what's out there from what shops what type of um, artwork there is at different shops and so yes all right so without further ado I'm gonna go ahead and start with the first third party okay so I decided to um, open up the boxes sorry don't mind my ring <laughs> i still have the turkey from thanksgiving <laughs> but anyway um i decided to open the boxes off camera just because it does take a little bit of time um but for my first artwork i got hannah lynn first snow i believe this one is discontinued from diamond art club Oops, sorry about that and this is round diamonds and it's a 51 by 71 canvas so I'm very excited for that. Sorry, I also forgot to mention, I did get First Snow from Mercari, as well as this one, my second one. This is Mona from Hannah Lynn. She's so beautiful. She is 61 by 41, and she is Round Diamonds from Diamond Art Club. I also got her from Mercari. I think I might have said that. <clears throat> Excuse me, sorry. Um, but yeah, so if you're actually looking to de-stash, um, Mercari and eBay are really good places to sell. All right, third one up, we have Jade's Treasure. I believe this is a Mandy Manzano, um, piece, and this is a 42 by 42, also from Diamond Art Club. It is round diamonds, and I got this one on eBay. Okay, this one took me a minute to get out of the box. <sighs> okay, so here I have my fourth piece. This one is Arabian Nights by Kelly Horton. And it is a 56 by 79. I believe this one is retired as well. Um, I think actually so far all of them are retired. But don't quote me on that. <laughs> this is from Diamond Art Club, Round Diamonds. You are more than welcome to check on Diamond Art Club to see if you can find any of these. Um, but yeah, I think they are retired. Um, and I got this one on eBay, I believe. Yeah, this one's from eBay. Um, this one I got from Mercari. Um, they are all Hannah Lynn's and I actually got it from the same seller. So she was able to do like a whole um, separate order for me. And so first up, I have Alley Cat. Um, this is a square 18, I'm sorry, 46 by 64. This is from Diamond Art Club. She is retired. And then I got Angie and Oliver by Hannah Lynn. This is a 42 by 59 square, also by Diamond Art Club. I think 
this one's also retired. And then I got Alice Lost by Hannah Lynn, square, 70 by 89. This is a pretty big one. Um, also by Diamond Art Club. So there's just a few more Hannah Lynn's that I, I know are retired that I'm trying to get my hands on. Like Ladybug Love and Dee Dee, but I haven't been lucky enough to find it. But if anyone out there has those that they want to de stash from their pile, just hit me up in the comments and I'll be more than happy to purchase them from you. Um, but yeah, let's move on to the actual companies now. Okay, I'm back. And I'm back with some diamond painting shop. Um, this is actually my first from this company. I'm super excited. Most of my stash contains of um, Diamond Art Club for the most part. And then last video, I did get some Orloa as well as um, Craftably. But I also do have some Dreamer designs, but I'm going to have to do a separate video on that because, yeah, I kind of went like crazy at that store <laughs> but anyway um yeah so let me start opening my diamond painting shop and i'll be right back all right so let's see what we got here oh this is so cute so we have some little candies that's so cute and then we got washi tape I'm actually building my collection on washi tape too, even though I still have to learn how to use it properly. Um, so we have two washi tapes and then a little thank you with a coupon code. That's awesome. And then some stickers and I don't know what these are because these aren't the paintings I got. So I'm hoping that it's just maybe samples of what else they offer in their shop. This one is actually really pretty though. I might have to look for that one. <laughs> I absolutely love lilies. So let's see here. So that was from baggie number one. I did see three baggies because I did order three diamond arts. And then baggie number two. So same thing. There's two washies, some candy, a little thank you card. <clears throat> and then I think stickers. Maybe these are stickers. I'm not sure. I'll have to test it out later. I know this one is a sticker for sure. But awesome. And then last baggie, super cute. Ooh, I got an Easter one, perfect. That'll be good for my Easter diamond arts. More Smarties, which I love Smarties. Sorry, don't mind my gobble gobble back there. And then, oh, this is so cute. I like that they sent me all different little diamond stickers. These are so cute. Definitely gonna use them in my log book. And a little thank you card. All right. Now to the boxes. Diamond painting shop. So it says DIY diamond art kit. All inclusive. See back for contents. Supporting artists with every purchase. So diamond um, painting shop does license their artwork, which is absolutely a must. So that is awesome. Um, it doesn't really give. Oh, here. All right, so this is, uh, I'm trying to think what the name of this one is. I think it's called like Little Candle Girl or something like that. I know it's something about a candle girl, <laughs> sorry. Um, but it is by Jasmine Becky Griffith. It's a square 50 by 65. Um, I'll go ahead and put the actual title on the screen. That way, if in case you want to get it, you can purchase it at Diamond Painting Shop. Um, but I do believe you can search up um, the artist's name and it'll pull up all of their artwork that they carry. All right, next up, again, Diamond Painting Shop. Their boxes are really, really cute. I like it. 
Um, here we have, I believe this one is called Bootstrap Betty. This is also by Jasmine Beckett Griffith. This is a square 65 by 50. Oh, sorry about that. And then last in this box, Diamond Painting Shop, we have a square 50 by 65. I know that they have this artwork um, on another site too. Uh, where did I see it? I think it was either Dreamer Designs or Craftably. Um, I'm not for sure, but I'll, I'll definitely... Um, link both shops on here that way you can check it out and this one is something about fireflies <laughs> i'm so sorry i'm like i bought so many that i just can't remember the titles but i'll also put it up on the screen okay now to get into box number two i'll just do that real quick Hopefully their box is not that difficult to open. Not like some of the other packaging. Mostly the third parties. They like to use a lot of tape. <laughs> All right. So here we have our candies and our washi tape again. So we have baggie number one with our candies and our stickers. Baggie number two, candies. Baggie number three, candies. So awesome. All right. So first up, we have Diamond Painting Shop. And oh, this one doesn't have the artwork on the bottom. Maybe on the top. Oh, yep, yeah, here it is. All right. So we have another Hannah Lynn. This is a 57 by 80. Um, I'm going to have to put the information on the screen because I'm not sure if it's round or square. I think it's round, but I could be wrong. And I honestly don't remember the title. <laughs> I'm so bad, especially because I love Hannah Lynn and I can't even remember the artwork name. But yes, this is number one. These boxes are huge. All right, diamond painting shop, not on the bottom, so it must be on the top. This one is so cute. I cannot wait to do this one. She looks so cute. So this one is 57 by 80, and I am absolutely so excited to get this one done. She's so pretty. Again, I'm going to have to <laughs> put the um, details on the screen for you, the name and the type of drills. I believe, again, it's round, but... I could be wrong. Oh, look, we have special drills. Yeah, so it must be round because these are all round, unless it's just for this one in particular. But that's cool. They sent some ABs, some orange ABs, and this is Diamond Painting Shop. And oh, yeah, see, it can't go with this one because I don't see any orange in this one. But this one is also Hannah Lynn, 57 by 72, and she is absolutely adorable. These are the only three Hannah Lynn's that um, Diamond Painting Shop carries at the moment, but I believe they're all still in stock. So if you are interested in any of these, feel free to jump on their site and pick them up because they're so cute. And again, I'm going to have to put the details on the screen, her name, and um the type of drills but i'm pretty sure it's round which i'm assuming because i got rounds and that wraps it up for diamond shop i'll be right back with the next order Alrighty, guys i am back with some orloa um i'm kind of sad because my box came like this um but i did double check to make sure nothing was missing and thankfully everything is there um again this is a lot of savings going into these so i can't really afford to have anything stolen or missing but thank god it is all here so without further ado let me get started all 
All right, so first up from Oralora. And again, I'm so sorry. I probably am going to butcher the names of these the, these artists and or um, titles because I have no idea how to pronounce it properly. So please forgive me. I'm going to try my hardest. Um, so here we have Entre le Crepuscule et... Laub? <laughs> I'm so sorry. That's the best I can do. But this is Square Diamonds and she is absolutely beautiful. I cannot wait to get this one done. And I think this one is by um, Maud Lavoye. I hope that's how you pronounce that too. Again, I'm so sorry if it's not. But I'm trying. Sorry, I have a little cold. That's why I keep... <clears throat> going like that so forgive me for that but yes this is the first one from Oraloa and she is beautiful oh sorry she is square diamonds if I didn't say that already and a 66 by 43 all right next up we have another Lar Felipon I think that's how you say her name. I'm so sorry if it's not. But this one is called Purple. It is a 40 by 40. So a nice size square diamonds. She is so beautiful. My favorite colors are pink and purple. So I'm very excited to do this one. Don't mind if I talk to myself a little bit. I tend to do that quite often. Um, all right. Now we have a Gail Picard. I believe that's how you pronounce your name. This is Chocolat, and it is a 36 by 50 square diamond. She is so cute. This one is so cute. I think I'm going to do this one for my daughter. Like, it's just, I love everything about this one. Okay. Next up, we have Winter Queen perfect for december by julia spiri this is a 51 i'm guessing 0.02 by 66.04 centimeters round diamonds this one is gonna look so beautiful i like when it's like almost a watercolor um type of artwork that's done with round diamonds i feel like it keeps that watercolor effect but again, so cute and beautiful. My baby, uh, my two-year-old, she actually loves um, Frozen. So I'm like so excited to get this one done. Oh, look what I found. I got some washi tape. A little tray that is so cute um, I believe that's some stickers in there a little thank you card and some gems well not gems but um, oh my gosh I'm so sorry I'm drawing a blank um, <laughs> um, yeah and these things <laughs> All right, so next up, we have another Lar Felipon. This is called Hawaii Girl. She is so cute. I think this is so adorable. My two-year-old also loves Moana. And, you know, you can't go wrong with a little hula girl. Love it. All right, next we have Wimsky by Julia Speary. This one is so cute. She's like a little baby doll. I just love this one, and I can't wait to get this one done. This one is a 48 by 60.96 centimeter round diamond, and I just absolutely love the pastels in this one, so this is definitely going to be really fun to work on. Um, sorry, I did forget to mention that um, the Hawaii girl is square diamonds, a 70 by 45 centimeter. Sorry about that. All 
And last but certainly not least, we are going to end our Oral Loa with some Hannah Lynn. This one is called Envy. It is a 70 by 50 centimeter square diamonds. Super cute. So I believe I do have all the available Hannah Lynn's on Oral Loa. Some of them are sold out, which I'm so sad. I definitely want to get my hands on hard on her sleeve. I think that one is so cute. Um, so again, if anyone is de that, just let me know. But yeah, so let me get to Diamond Art Club and I'll be back. All right, guys, I am back with my Diamond Art Club. So without further ado, let's get to opening. First up, we have Tara by Micah Jelena. This is a square 51 by 69 from Diamond Art Club. Secondly, we have Layla, also by Micah Jelena. This is a round 56 by 84 from Diamond Art Club. Third up, we have Adeline by Micah Jelena. As you can see, I have a pattern here. I think most of this shipment is Micah Jelena. This is a square 80 by 70, a nice size. I believe these are all still on Diamond Art Club. <clears throat> Not sure if there's any that got discontinued, but I think they're still on there. This is Bestie Lynn by Micah Jelena. There goes my turkey. <laughs> um, it is a square 69 by 55. Fifth, we have Forest Sprite. This one is by Christine Caron. This is a square 51 by 66. I just absolutely love the colors in her face. Look at how beautiful that is. I can't wait to see how the rendering turns out with all of these shadowing and contouring on her face. She's so beautiful. And I got some SpongeBob square pants to go with my collection. This is SpongeBob and Friends by Diamond Art Club. It is a square. Um, it is a 56 by 56. My son loves SpongeBob, so yeah, probably put this one up in his room. Next, we have Delphi or Delphi, sorry if that's how you pronounce it. But this is a Micah Jelena. I am so, so excited to do this one. She is so pretty and I love the style that they went with this one. Um, There's a round 51 by 102. So it is a long canvas, but this will probably take me a while to do, but she's so beautiful. I actually got two like these like this sorry and I didn't mean two of the same I got the other one in that same style the long canvas but we have Jolene here Micah Jolina around 50.7 by 68.6 Diamond Art Club I had to get this one. I think it is so cute. Breakfast spaghetti. This is by Elf. <laughs> I believe my husband absolutely loves this movie. It's by Diamond Art Club. I'm so happy I was able to snag this one. This is a 33 by 33, so a nice snack size. But I'm pretty sure this is going to either go up in his office or in, his, um, in the garage where he has his weights. Next, we have Angels With You by Willowing Arts. This is a round 56 by 74. Um, I actually bought this one um, because I'm hoping to get this one completed for my son's one year anniversary. Um, he passed away last year in April and I'm really hoping to get this one done. Sorry, getting a little emotional here, but 
yeah, that's why I purchased this one. And it is a round by Diamond Art Club. Oh, here she is. This is Iris by Micah Jelena. This is a round 51 by 107. Again, I am so excited to get this one done. Look at how beautiful these dark colors are. I just absolutely love it. It's like mermaid colors, which I absolutely love. The teal, purple, and magenta pink, all deep colors. But yeah, that is the last one from this box of Diamond Art Club. I'm going to go ahead and open the next Diamond Art Club box and I'll be right back. All right, guys, so this is the last of my delivery. Um, it's gonna end with Diamond Art Club. So my husband and I have kind of been on a Harry Potter binge. So when I saw these on Diamond Art Club, I wanted to have them. So here we have our cute, Little Hermione Granger. This is a square 70 by 70, and it is by Harry Potter with Diamond Art Club. Sorry, Diamond Art Club. And of course, we can't get Harry Potter without Luna Lovegood. Absolutely love her, she is adorable. Also, a Harry Potter Diamond Art Club. And this one is a 70 by 70 as well. More to go with our SpongeBob collection. We have SpongeBob SquarePants Krabby Patties. And this is also a Diamond Art Club Square Kit. And it is 103 by 70. So this is a big one. And it is going to be confetti heavy because of all those Krabby Patties. <sighs> Don't mind me. Sorry, guys, if I sound a little out of breath. I went upstairs just to go check on my baby real quick. He is fast asleep. All right, now I have Moonlight by Chris Ortega. This is a round 51 by 76 by Diamond Art Club. She's so pretty. Another Harry Potter. We have another version of Hermione Granger. This one is called Schoolwork and Friends. It is Diamond Art Club, Square Diamonds, and we are at 51 by 71 centimeters. This one is so cute. I like the way they did the artwork for her. All right, and we're back to my girl Jasmine Beckett Griffith. We have Darling Dragonling 2. This is a round 56 by 69 Diamond Art Club. Perfect for Halloween. And another Jasmine Beckett Griffith. We have Faces of Fairy 132. This is a round 51 by 51. And this will be a cute little snacky Christmas by Diamond Art Club. Alrighty, here we have a Dragonling Valentine. Also perfect for Valentine. This is by Jasmine Beckett Griffith. It is a round 43 by 61. This one is beautiful. I love the whites in this. I hope they're ABs because that shine in her hair and on the dragon is gonna look absolutely stunning. And last but not least from Diamond Art Club, 
This is a square diamond kit called Nova by Mica Jelena. This is a 47 by 64, mostly dark colors. This one should be pretty quick. It looks like there's a lot of color blocking in this, so kind of excited to do this one. Alrighty guys, well thank you so much for being with me throughout this delivery unboxing. I hope you enjoy. I have many more videos to come that I will be posting soon. And again, if you're not already subscribed, please subscribe and like my channel. You can go ahead and also hit that little bell so that you'll get notified when I do upload more videos. Alright guys, have a good rest of your day. Bye!